considers Lance Armstrong a serious threat to his crown this year. The pair haven't met yet, but the, the Australian and the cycling great are on a collision course called Kona. Craig Alexander convinced that Lance Armstrong is a genuine contender to win this year's Hawaiian Ironman. Absolutely is. Anyone who thinks he's not is, I think, is deluded. Armstrong with a mind-blowing performance in his comeback to the sport, a half Ironman in Panama, just eight seconds off the winner in a world-class field. His performances have been what I thought they would be, which is outstanding. Lance himself is playing it down. No expectations on my part, but I'll do whatever I need to do to, to train hard, be prepared, learn as much as I can. And learn off the best. Armstrong's people contacting Alexander with an invitation to attend a week-long camp with the cycling great in Hawaii in a month's time. Wily old Lance at it again. The bottom line is if he's there trying to pick my brain for information, he'll find me a very boring guest. And uh, in fact, I might just lay around the pool, sipping drinks with colourful straws in him and playing golf and, and telling him that's how you train for the Ironman. Armstrong's considered by many the greatest endurance athlete ever. His seven Tour de France titles testament to that. But as a triathlete, Lance is an unknown quantity, right? Wrong. Lance was a triathlete before he was a cyclist, and he was a world-class triathlete in his teenage years. And the 15 years old wonder boy from Dallas, Lance Armstrong. Lance Armstrong's really incredible. He's had some great races this year. Bring on October. It could be the greatest race in Kona we've seen. Rob Canning, 10 News. Now this one's for.